All right, so we are back today with more iPad OS 16 goodness. And the biggest question that I received in the past day or so is what's up with gaming? So like people want to know if you close it, will it shut off? Yes, if you close it down, it will shut off. So that question is answered. Hands down, if you close it, it will shut itself off. The other biggest question was, can you use this without it being connected to the Magic Keyboard? Which right now I got it on the Magic Keyboard, so if I take it off the Magic Keyboard, check that out. Now, you take it off the Magic Keyboard and the black bars come up. So I know it's blurry back there, I'm doing that on purpose, so just to go ahead and announce it. If you take it off the Magic Keyboard, the black bars come up and when I reattach it back to the Magic Keyboard, the desktop setup comes up. So that's one of the other questions. If you use it for AirPlay mode, you are going to get black bars. Just hands down, you're gonna get black bars. I don't have to do it, just trust me, trust what I'm telling you. Also, if you're using this with older model iPads, anything except the M1 version of the iPad, you're going to get black bars on the side of the screen. Okay, those questions out of the way. Now, one of the other biggest things was gaming. We're coming back to that. So a lot of people wanted to know what is the gaming experience like on this um, iPad OS 16. I can tell you right now that it is non-existent right now for the large external display. Now, I'm gonna try it on some other external displays, but for right now, I'm using my M8, my Samsung monitor, and gaming is not working. So when I say gaming is not working, this is what I mean. So I'm still able to use one of my favorite controllers. This is my Xbox controller, and I'm gonna be using the mouse over here. You can see it on the main external display. And let's just select our Apple Arcade game. This is how they show up. This is what happens. This is what they look like. Now, one of the other games that I like to play is Fallen Knight, and they're all showing up in this like portrait landscape mode. <laughs> so the picture is actually in a portrait mode, but it's just laid sideways. So that is what you are getting. Now, it is still functional. Like I can still choose and I can still play, but no one can really play like that. So we get it. We know that we are in a beta mode. We know that that's what we're running on this. This is preliminary software, and I'm gonna give them a few weeks to get all the kinks out, but for everyone out there asking, as far as the gaming goes right now, you're not gonna be able to use that external display for these games. They still work on the regular iPad, which they should, but as far as the external display playing Apple Arcade games, even regular, even regular applications, it's not working right now. So hopefully this has been able to help someone out. And like I said, this is beta, take it with a grain of salt, but all the other things we talked about as far as shutting the iPad on the Magic Keyboard, it is going to go off. Taking the iPad off the Magic Keyboard will put those black bars on the screen and you still get black bars on the screen if you have any other iPad other than an M1. So just keep that in mind. Hopefully this has been able to help someone out and until next time, please be sure and give me that big thumbs up. Please subscribe. Average Tech Guy out. Peace.